okay episode 152 okay <laughs> again with the host and Katsura is a girl <laughs> I didn't notice that <laughs> enigmatic very former number one was chain <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, said the Haru. Oh, who's that girl? Oh, Okita. Oh, is that Kondo? <laughs> Kondo is also blonde. Chachan. Whoa. <laughs> oh. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, that's the the cross does. Yeah, he did that from the when they with Gin. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gin <laughs> Tamaka. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the shogun is here, <laughs> and even Matsudaira. And I've wondered they already made a perimeter in this area. I guess Kagura doesn't have an idea. He, he wasn't there when the Shogun. Which I don't remember. Oh, she she does know. <laughs> yeah, I guess this is the only place that's doing Mage. It's the only place left. What a perfect timing for him to do, to try to become a commoner. 
At least Matsudaira's leaving, so at least that's one. <laughs> So there's no perim perimeter, that's another good thing. <laughs> no. <laughs> At least they're, they're asleep, so... There's still a bit of... Hope for them not to meet. But the problem is they know who he is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what if they wound him or something? <laughs> oh, I'm worried because Kagura is still there. I don't think she knows that he's the Shogun. <laughs> oh, I wonder. I hope, but I th I think Kagura Kagura's the one's going to do something. It will mess things up even more. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Oh, Kagura knows. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I think she's... She... Maybe she's an Amanda so she could take care of herself. Part of the end of... She just vomited. <laughs> I think they should they should clean up that first. We're barely okay. <laughs> oh, that that definitely smells bad. This is not really. I guess. I guess the good thing is he doesn't have an idea of what what this is supposed to be because he said that he wanted to experience this for the first time and maybe he's assuming this is what the commoners is experiencing all the time <laughs> what about the vomit in his back at his back oh that's like <laughs> Why is it? What? The? What? The? <laughs> what is that thing? Why can't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 that definitely smells so bad. <laughs> if it just came out from Ka Kagura's stomach. Oh, what you doing? <laughs> oh no! Oh no, no, no! Oh, I feel like <laughs> she's got. She might peel off a skin or something. Oh god, no, we'll see this. 
<laughs> yeah, their life, their life is in the line. <laughs> This feels kind of weird. I feel like they might ch chip off a skin or something. <laughs> what does it look like? dead because <laughs> because if we cut that from from the sound <laughs> <laughs> Because I remember that's like the owner of a samurai. <laughs> and this is not a skin or something. But the <laughs> they might have to tape it off or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even in, <laughs> even in the, <laughs> even in this case, he's trying hard to process everything. <laughs> oh man, what the. <laughs> Yeah, I thought, I really thought that it's going to be Kaguya. <laughs> it's going to make things r messed up even more. <laughs> but... We just trim this. <laughs> His scalp, man. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> the shogun is thinking is that this is what the com commoners are experiencing so <laughs> it's like a demon or something oh man this is an episode it's good oh man. <laughs> Solution is going to be. But I'm assuming it's not there anymore. Yeah.
<laughs> is that... <laughs> <laughs> is that <laughs> was it was it made from <laughs> is it is it from <laughs> I go oh no <laughs> this is <laughs> What is that? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I think if if anyone else is saying this, they they're definitely dead. They're so dead. <laughs> I guess the, you kind of feel bad <laughs> for the Shogun. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Ah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I hope they keep that haircut for Katsura for quite a while just to make I think Katsura will kill this too <laughs> if he finds out what they've done with his hair. I don't think, I don't think it's that, the mage. Maybe it's some, <laughs> maybe it's really, maybe it's a poop or something. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Run. Just run away, they don't know you. <laughs> they don't recognize you. <laughs> oh man, I feel bad for the owner. <laughs> <laughs> this is the curly hair. <laughs> and there's something written at the back. Oh man, the Shogun. I guess... Oh... Yeah. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> I guess the good thing is the positive thing. Is, yeah, that's <laughs> and somewhat ended well for for them. <laughs> oh, the problem is Katsura would recognize Kondo. 
I think Kondo won't recognize Katsura, but Katsura will definitely recognize Kondo. <laughs> what happened? Whoa! Wow! Wow! <laughs> what a plot twist! Yeah! <laughs> Sanin! <laughs> wow! <laughs> At least it all it ends well. So it also I think Jake somewhat improved the perspective of the. Shogun and uh, I guess with the commoners, um, commoners uh, point of view, but it's kind of extreme, especially <laughs> he happened to face with uh, those three <laughs> legendary Sanin and uh, yeah, <laughs> I hope they they keep that haircut for Katsura just to um, just for continuity or something, <laughs> and that they could make fun of him or something. Cause I think that <laughs> that would uh, take take a lot of time before it grows back to a very long hair, and but I guess I'm not sure if they would. Cause I guess maybe it's just for this episode for this arc. But yeah, this episode this arc is really <laughs> it's so it's so funny and yeah thing things went um really <laughs> really extreme in this episode and. Yeah, I kind of feel bad for the Shogun at the same time. Um, I guess it kind of... Kind of made him... Um, it It's his change, his point of view for the... For his people is... I guess it made him more... Um, more comp compassionate towards the people in... Um, in the form with with things like that that there will um especially for the owner of this barber is i think even though um uh, modern times usually needs to keep up with the with the trend or something it's still um very still very important to preserve the culture of uh, uh especially with with uh with the samurai so at least because uh, the shogun was still embracing the magi haircut and yeah, he wanted he wanted the commoners to at the, at the same time be able still be able to have the experience of um, I guess I guess uh, having a decent um, haircut of pamage and something like that. At the same time, he wants also to he also wants to preserve the culture. I think so. Yeah, in the end, it's been a great um, great way for the shogun to have that experience and. To finally have the, I guess the motivation to create, a, to reform, create a, re a reform, not just with the with the with that barbershop, but also with with uh, with the whole Edo. So I think, um, hopefully that's that's the case, and that he will he will um also look in other areas of the the peop for the, of the people, um, not just with the. Uh, with the haircut but it's a great start and yeah <laughs> I guess in the end uh, it's the Yorozuya who who made it <laughs> who made the change but at the same time <laughs> if uh, someone else was seeing that they definitely they, <laughs> they would been, they would had had their heads cut off but um yeah, I guess I really thought that this episode, this arc, will be about um, Kondo getting a makeover or something. But I think the the main focus of this um, this arc is been about the uh, the Shogun and also at the same time the the barbers, the barber shop for with regards to um, preserving the culture at the same time. 
So yeah, it's a cool episode, and I really, <laughs> I really had fun watching this, uh, this arc. And you also had the, I'm not sure if that's the conclusion of the, the um. Somewhat noir, kinda. Um, story of the of Gintama with Gin being his, having his blonde hair, or something. <coughs> But yeah, um, yeah. Uh, what else? Um, yeah, I think that's much more about this. Uh, this whole arc, and and um, what else happened in this episode? <coughs> yeah, Matsudaira didn't really take much. Um, didn't have any much uh, participation in this. This episode, he was just there <laughs> to escort the. I guess it's not really there to escort. I think he just wants to have some good, uh, an excuse to be able to have a good time at the same time be paid while doing it as a work work or something. So, I guess <laughs> he was really planning to go to the bar or something instead of <laughs> trying to escort the shogun, which is definitely a priority. So. At the same time, there was there wasn't any perim- perimeter. I thought that this is going to be somewhat a about the Shinsengumi and the Jui, but in the end, I think it's it's really leaned on it really leaned on the the Shogun <laughs> and the Shogun and the, I guess the pressure to gain in the other because they're they're the only ones who who felt the pressure in that situation where the Jui the first first uh, the Shinsengumi. The, then the Jui and then now the, the Shogun so yeah definitely if you're in that kind of situation where your life is on the line and <laughs> you have no idea on what to do in that situation so you're not really you d- don't really have any skills for that and it's, it's going to be your life on the line definitely you would feel the pressure and that's so <laughs> and it started with and it started all with Kagura <laughs> So yeah, it's at least she did try to do something, but yeah, uh, it's kind of cool that uh, even that happened. With that happened, um, Gin and Shinpachi still try to uh, fix fix the problem and find a, a solution. So uh, in the end, uh, it won't it won't end bad for them, badly for them, and it just shows how much of a uh, a bond this three has because <laughs> uh yeah because if it's the uh, if it's other people they would just leave it alone or get maybe just um blame it to kagura instead uh but but yeah uh, her being like the little sister of the group so they still find the <laughs> try try to fix the the almost impossible task if it weren't for the I guess the the nature of the the shogun, they would <laughs> they wouldn't be able to um es- uh, escape that situation. I guess the the <clears throat> the good the only thing good thing is that nobody recognizes them. So in the end, um, they were like um just a um like a a legend or something. So no 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 one really saw them. So. Yeah, so that's I uh, what I think with this arc in this episode. How about you guys to share your comments on, on the link? Uh, on the uh, just share your, just leave your comments on the just leave your thoughts on the comments down below and uh, please like this video if you enjoyed watching and if this is your first time here, please subscribe so you'll be updated whenever I upload my Rasha to Gintama. And if you want to watch the next episode, you could do that right now by going to my Patreon in the link in the description down below. And it would really help support this channel. And uh, thank you very much for watching. See you in my next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.